Unit 2, Recording 10.1, Food Security, Section 2. Many experts in agriculture agree that to ensure food security and to feed a growing global population, when 820 million people are classified as living in hunger, is a global challenge. It is vital to establish an equality of nutritious and healthy food supply between developed and developing countries. Almost all the hungry people live in lower middle income countries. Yet, Developed and developing countries have different approaches to food security. It is a critical issue in the low-income countries and a challenge of providing population with sufficient food to eat. While in high-income countries, where there are 11 million people undernourished, food security is establishing a balance between the quantity of food produced in the country and the amount a country imports. Furthermore, it is a balance between the land used for agriculture and the land which is used for other purposes, for example, for building, and it is also a correlation between the benefits and the cost of food security to the population, for instance, the cost of climate change and the cost of measures to mitigate it. So, to increase sustainability in the world, it is crucial to tackle the imbalance and insufficiency in developing countries, where food security is not balancing the benefits and costs, but finding ways to ensure a necessary amount of nutritious food. These countries lack resources to build strategies to deal with emergency situations related to the effect of climate change on the production of raw materials. In the current world economy, they do not get a fair return for the commodities and food they produce. That means they are unable to invest into modern technology to improve agriculture and agribusiness. Therefore, in developing countries, food security means far more simple factors. It is the proportion of the income the population spends on food and the levels of malnutrition and hunger in the country. In the modern world, there remain two major issues related to food security. The first concerns the effect of climate change, the hazards it causes for global food production and food change, and how people can reduce them. And the second issue is inequality between developed and developing countries, as the global community still favours the interests of high-income countries, which capitalise at the expense of low-income countries. The issue is to find ways to move towards a fairer global economy, where developing countries will be able to receive a fair price for their produce and labour to improve their agriculture and agribusiness.